Welcome to this new video where we will look at some tricks to quickly process the Milky Way using Astro Panel and Neural Mask. But before we start, as usual, I remind you to leave a like, a comment, and subscribe to the channel by activating the bell. Let's get started right away. Let's start with Fusion. Go to the Sky Stack category. Load the light. Dark and if we have them, the bias or flat frames. Activate the alignment, leave these settings unchanged. Choose a width area between 40 and 50 if we are merging wide field images. Click on place to choose the star. I recommend choosing one that is bright and fairly central. Press Confirm to confirm our choice and click on Start to begin the process. Then, we wait for it to finish. In my case, with 10 light and 5 dark frames, it only took 41 seconds to finish the process. Before doing anything else, let's immediately go to the Astro Panel plugin and in the star selection, press Reduce to reduce the stars so we can focus more on the nebulosity. Now in my case, I need to rotate the image. Then, with Ctrl plus L, we open the levels and stretch the image. Open the levels again, and with the color dropper, click on a black point to remove any color cast. Now, let's prepare Neural Mask by clicking on Dark Sky 1. Next, choose the dark setting that best contrasts the dark parts of the nebulosity. In this case, the 3 is perfect, so click on Apply. This has enhanced and slightly separated the dark areas from the nebulosity. Now, return to Astro Panel go to Tools and click on Dodge and Burn Magic. Click OK without making any changes, then click OK again. At this point, we should be enhancing the parts of the nebulosity. Do the same for the dark areas. Now, using a white brush, Paint on the mask over the areas you want to enhance in terms of darkness. Use the dodge tool on the areas you want to brighten. Next, click on Dynamic Contrast. Accept the suggested settings with OK. You should immediately notice the difference between the before and after the action. Proceed to the Milky Way section. Click on Dark Sky 2. And select the mask you previously used with Dark Sky. Open it in Camera Raw. Increase the clarity to better define the contrasts, boost the contrast, and increase the whites to have more effect on the interested areas. Then click Apply. Adjust the opacity of the layer to your liking. Create a new Curves layer. Duplicate the Dark Sky Mask onto the Curves layer by holding down the Alt key, select the mask by holding Shift, and invert it with Ctrl plus I. Now increase the exposure to enhance the contrast of the lights. Next, press on Saturation and increase the saturation as you see fit, being careful not to overdo it.
Let's quickly look at where we started and where we are now. If you want to slightly change the hue of the photo, create a new hue saturation layer, select a mid one, click apply, and then adjust the hue slightly. Then return to Astro Panel, click on Milky Way, and select Remove Green Cast. Use a white brush to remove any green tint from the photo. Let's review where we started. and I would say that the photo is now finished. That's all for this video. I remind you to leave a like and a comment with suggestions for the next video tutorials. Please subscribe to the channel and activate the bell so you don't miss any upcoming videos. See you next time.